hi guys welcome back welcome to beauty zabi i hope you all are doing well shubho navaporsho this is the bengali new year the festive time and i hope you all have a great and amazing year ahead i just try to make a look this is a kind of evening look you can wear it in the evening or in the daytime whichever you choose very light makeup i have used as minimal makeup as possible especially this is a no foundation look something i always love you guys know i do not like using foundation so this is a no foundation look and as minimum makeup as possible so please keep on watching and if you are like this video then please do not forget to hit on the like button and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and so shubhan mawarsha once again and keep on watching first i'm going to use the pons bb cream to just i'm going to use the pons bb cream to mattify my face and cover blemishes or any spots if i have any i do not have any spot problem or any blemishes or anything and i think that this is the summer time your skin should breathe you should use as minimum makeup as possible especially foundation go easy on the foundation and anyways i do not like using foundation a lot so i thought of opting for bb cream this is the exact way how i uh, how i am going to get ready for navavarsha this year bengali new year this year so i always prefer using bb cream followed by the maybelline super stay matte 24 hours powder if you know me then you know this is my favorite go to press powder compact i love this this product is actually amazing it stays on your face actually for 24 hours and i have noticed this if i use this i do not have to retouch my face or do any kind of touch up frequently i actually do not do any kind of touch up this is the look after the bb cream and the powder i am completely happy with little bit of spots i don't mind next i'm going to use the Ma revolution makeup revolution palette the makeup details will be given the product details will be given in the description box below please do check from there i'm using the nudist shade and i'm just creating a base for my eye shadow this product is amazing this is a matte eye shadow palette it has bronzer and blush and highlighter as well which i would be using throughout the video i love this palette so i'm using the nude shade from here just to create a base for the eye shadow that i'm going to use and i am going to do a champagne bronzy eye today i love doing nude eye makeup especially something in bronze champagne or gold that is something i love next i'm going to use the shivana colors palette all the shade numbers and the details will be given please do check i'm repeating please do check the description box if you want to know the product what i'm doing out here i'm creating an outer v using the darkest shade it's a black glittery shade uh, what i'll do right now is i'll just create a v and i'm intensifying the color towards the end as i to in us the uh, inner corner of my eyes i'm keeping it light because i'm to i'll put some champagne color out there that is the kind of look i'm trying to create today so make sure that your outer v is dark and i'll blending is the key please blend your eye shadow as much as possible that will soften your look and as well as your eye shadow will stay on for a longer duration of time it is very important next i am using the champagne color from the same palette and i'm placing it in the inner corner and the center of my eyelids just in the center and the inner corners and nowhere else outer corner will be that dark brown black color which i have used to create the v and this is the kind of eye i am looking for the champagne color will pop out because of the light in the evening then i am using the same brown color or the black brown color which i used before to intensify the outer corner once again because due to blending some of the eye shadows must have got lost so i'm just using using the same color to in intensify the outer corner once again make sure that you blend your eye shadow very nicely it is very important to blend your eye shadow i'm telling it once again 
then I would be using the white color from the same palette and I would be highlighting my brow bone what this step will do it will uplift your eye uh, brow bones and it will make your eyes look much bigger this is one simple trick to make your eyes look bigger if any of my beauties have small eye problem if your eyes look very droopy then this is one step that you can always follow to make your eyes look bigger make sure you use the same color on the inner corners to make your eyes again pop out it is very important never forget that step i'm taking the champagne color again to use it on the outer uh, waterline of my eyes i'll just use this color a little bit next i'm using the plum kajal and tight lining my lower waterline and upper waterline using the same product this is an amazing kajal and it is waterproof and smudge proof it is really 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 amazing i love this kajal recently this is the one go to product that i'm using constantly then my favorite liner the l'oreal magique liner i would use this uh, liner to create a winged look not very bold not very subtle a uh, minimum one which can be worn during the daytime as well that is the kind of liner i'm going to do today so i'll just take proper time to make the wing liner as perfect as possible that is the attention of this eye the eye makeup will pop out if you use proper champagne color and your eyeliner is on fleek it is very very important to make sure that your eyeliner is on fleek do not forget the mascara it is very important it will open up your eyes and again another step which will make your eyes look bigger even if you don't want to use any kind of eye makeup no kajal no liner no eyeshadow a simple mascara a coat of mascara will make a big difference huge difference you can try it I'll now bronze my face using the same makeup revolution palette. I'm not a much of a bronzing person and as I said th it is hot so I'm trying to use as minimum makeup as possible. I'm just making a fish face and bronzing my cheeks a bit to create that cheekbone or contour my cheeks a little bit, little bit of more bronzer on my neck just to bronze up the neck area and nothing else do not use a lot of products i'm saying once again my beauties because summertime you really don't want to don't you want your makeup to go a little messy and you can wear this makeup very easily and go out as well even if it's very sunny or hot nothing will happen your makeup will be on place i'll just bronze my nose a bit and contour my nose a lot a bit too then i'm using the same palette and i'm using the blusher from that palette on the apple of on the apples of my cheek i love this palette as i said before and this blush is very neutral light pink shade and it gives you that perfect color that you need for the daytime look of yours then i will be using the highlight from this palette and do, do you see that wow that amazing highlighter it has a bomb big time shine I would use it to highlight my bridge of my nose, my cupid's bow and also my cheek, my chin bone and also on, on, on my forehead especially near my eyebrows so that all these places are uplifted and my face look really brightened up. The simple step can make your face look really glowing. I'm not using a lot of the products. Sorry, the clip for the lipstick got missed somewhere. I used a color bar lipstick. I'll mention the shade in the description box below. I put on a bindi, and this is the finished look, guys. I hope you all like this. It's very simple, very go to. Little bit bold lip color that I've used, and my eyes are very neutral, brown, bronzy with shimmer champagne color in the center as you can see i have not used a lot of products i've tried to keep the makeup as minimum as possible and this is how i have come with the look i hope you enjoyed this video and if you did please don't forget to hit on the like button if you're someone visiting my channel for the first time please make sure you subscribe to my channel and click on the red bell button this dress i got somewhere from a boutique in delhi i'll mention i try to mention the shop if possible and this is what I am planning to wear for Nubavar show this year. I hope you all have a lot of fun on Bengali New Year. Wishing all a happy New Year once again. And Shubhu Nubavar show. Make sure you hit on the subscribe button. Love you all. Keep smiling. Bye bye.